All right, everyone, we're gearing up for the Memorial Cup. We know this, so joining us this morning, we have Craig Gosselin, the man himself. Thanks for being here, Craig. How are you? Blake, it's great to be here, as always. I'm glad to yeah. have you. All right, so what's the uh, latest developments to our Memorial Cup festivities? Well, it's uh, Kayla Payak is our local event manager for the Memorial Cup. Okay. And uh, we just announced Walker Hayes, the country star, is going to be here June 1st uh, at the Joel Crutton Event Park. That's a big deal. Uh, also, we just announced, too, that the staging that we're putting in is going to be an incredible stage. So even our local artists, every day we're going to have a concert in the Joel Crutton Event Park of the Memorial Cup. Starts May 23rd, goes through June 2nd. Mm -hmm. uh, so the entire fan fest uh, that's put on by UA Local 85, uh, grateful to them, uh, is going to be spectacular. Yeah. So even if you don't go to the hockey games, you're going to want to come down to the Memorial Cup be part of the festivities, food truck alleys, all kinds of new activities going on down there that's going to be really special. The Hockey Hall of Fame is going to have their display there with the Stanley Cup for a couple of days. Nice. Just incredible amount of activity with all the different face painters, balloon artists, uh, you know, all the different vendors that are there. It's going to be a celebration of something really cool happening in our community with the Memorial Cup. I was going to say, it sounds like you could get a celebration inside or outside the Dow yes. event center, no matter what. Yep. That is so cool. All right, playoffs. What is it looking like for uh, the Spirit? Well, last night we had our first playoff game against yeah. Owen Sound, and that's a very good team we're playing against. By, by the way, just so your, your, your viewers understand Owen Sound was uh, uh, the, the, the forecasters at, at, before the season started yeah. had Owen Sound as a team that was going to win the, the OHL uh, championship so yeah. they're a very very good team and uh, and they end up at the seventh seed which uh, you know we got we're gonna have to play hard to beat this team and last night it, it that came to fruition this is a very good team we're playing uh, and it was a 2-2 game for a long time we ended up winning the game 6-4 in front of a huge crowd uh, exciting time so we, get, we play Saturday night at the Dow for game two yeah. uh, and then we go back there on Monday for game three and and, uh, and Wednesday for Game Four, so it's a it's an incredible. So I would invite the fans to come out. It's a the, the team is so uh, this is the most talented team we've ever had, Blake. And, yeah. and we're, we don't want to back into the Memorial Cup. We're already in the Memorial Cup as the host, but we want to win the OHL championship and earn our way in. And if we do that. Blake, the team that we play in the OHL Championship, then will be the second team in the Memorial Cup this year. So we're hoping that's what's going to happen, and it starts right now by beating the Owens on attack. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah, we had some of the highlights in a wake up this morning, so uh, we know how good the Spirit players yeah. are. Yeah. Um, other teams to look out for the Spirit. Well, Owen Sound is one. We're, uh, right now, we've got our, our focus to on, uh, right now on Owen Sound. Okay. Uh, and uh, when you look around uh, the league, there, there, there's so much parity uh, in the league. and. Uh, and it's uh, you look at the London Knights; they're perennial champions, right? right. And uh, we all we all want to uh, uh, have a shot at London somewhere down the road. Uh, if it's not us, uh, uh, you know, we all want to beat London, right? Yeah. And uh, they've been incredible. And, and uh, now Saginaw has got themselves in that same status as an elite franchise. So mm -hmm. when teams come here, that's one of the challenges that we've had now. Is when teams come here, they want to beat Saginaw. All right, this is an elite franchise. We've been ranked in the top five of the CHL all year long. Yeah. And uh, so now it's it's great. So our players are getting everybody's best. And, uh, and you're seeing that on the ice. It's incredible talent, Blake. Incredible talent on both teams. These are future NHLers right here playing in Saginaw, and it's uh, pretty special in the playoffs. It takes it up another notch. Right. So every move of the puck gets exemplified, and, uh, and, it's, uh, and the fans are just all over this thing. It was, uh, we're so grateful to our fans. We have the greatest fans, and last night it proved it. It was so loud yeah. in the Dow. Every, every, so if you haven't been to a, to a spirit game, I really invite you to come out and enjoy something really cool happening in our community. It's very community yeah. bonding. Yeah. 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 All right. So for our fans who still want to get involved in the Memorial Cup action, how can they do that? Best way to do it, Blake, is just to go on SaginawSpirit.com. Uh -huh. It's easy, and, and at the top, you can there, there's a there's a bar, and go to the Memorial Cup, and uh, and and scroll down to the to uh, whatever you'd like to get involved in the Fan Fest or tickets. If you want tickets, better get your tickets soon. We're at 80% capacity in the eight games. We have eight games in 10 days, and we were at 60% capacity 30 days ago. Yeah. Now we're at 80. Uh, so we know in the next uh, in the next three weeks those tickets will sell out. That you, means that. Yeah, right? you, you don't want to be left out. So get your tickets now. Go to SaginawSpirit.com or come into our store, yeah. 6321 State Street, next to Timbers, and uh, and and uh, see the girls in there, and they can take care of you. So yeah, it's uh, get your tickets now because they'll be. Uh, They'll be they'll be gone in three weeks. Absolutely, yeah, so. great shop too. Love yeah. it there. Yeah, yeah, it is. Yeah, it's a fun <laughs> spot to hang out. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> All right, Craig, this is great. The countdown's going to begin soon. Once we hit April, just another month and a half to go. Thanks, Blake. Yeah, no, and it's going to be great. The rival of the Cup ceremony too is May 23rd, which is going to be special. It's like the rival Olympic torch. Yeah. And uh, we're going to be having that. Uh, WNEM, by the way, is going to be uh, showing that live. Mm -hmm. It's going to be so cool uh, in the community. We invite the entire community to be there on May 23rd, 4 p.m. at the Joel Credit Event Park as we present the cup uh, to the community of Saginaw. So it's going to be so, such, the Rival Cup is very similar to the Rival Olympic Torch. The Saginaw Bay Symphony Orchestra, Todd Michael Hall, <gasps> uh, nine marching bands we're going to have be, having this thing. So you're going to want to be there for this thing. So uh, we're inviting the whole community to pack 
that park. We hope we get 10,000 people there. So we'll, right. find, we'll find a spot for everybody. Well, let's do it. All right, Greg, <laughs> appreciate your time. Thanks, Thank Blake. You. Yeah, Anytime. You for all this great information to follow along with, go to the hot links section on our website at WNEM.com.